Let's do some more practice with these multiplicities of zeros to make sure you understand the concept. So the first thing we want to do is identify the zeros. When you're given the polynomial function in linear factored form, to find the zeros, all you have to do is simply solve for x. So our first zero is x equals 6, so at 6, at 1, and at negative 2. Now, if we were to graph this, where would it touch the x-axis? Touch it and then turn around. So that would be at the even degree uh, multiplicities. We have one even multiplicity, and that is at 1. So the other two zeros, we have a multiplicity of 1, which is an odd number. So it's going to cross at those two points. What is the degree of this polynomial? Well, to find the degree, recall, all we have to do is simply add up the multiplicities to find the degree. So that would be 1 plus 2 plus 1. So this is a fourth degree polynomial. So what is the end behavior of this graph? Well, the fact that is it is a fourth degree polynomial, that's an even polynomial. Even is always both ends up or both ends down. And because we don't have any negatives out here uh, for our coefficient, it's going to be both ends up.